Hey guys, how you doing? A lot of you have been writing me asking me, why did you start a series called How to Make Money on YouTube? Only because I am asked that like every, every single week. It's like one of the top questions I get asked about YouTube. So I thought for two years, I thought, you know what? I'm just gonna finally tell you guys everything I went through, how to get started, how to market, how to do merchandise, all right? How to do Amazon, how to do other things. I'm gonna give you videos that will teach you everything. So on Saturdays, you can check out my videos. It's called How to Make Money on YouTube. It's a series for the serious YouTube creators, all right? But in the meantime, we have another low carb recipe. Are you guys ready? Ready for this? It's called a low carb lemon cheesecake squares. That just sounds delicious. And my wife looks at these recipes. She's like, where's the butter? Where's the crust? Where's the breadcrumbs? Where's the, she, cause she's getting so used to recipes. We've done so many. She's helped me through a lot. And I just want to say thank you, honey, very much. So come on in close and I'll show you all the ingredients. Ironically, there's very few ingredients to this. Let's take a look. All right, first I got the eggs. I got the swerve. I got the almond flour. I have some salt, some cream cheese. I believe this is the lemon extract right there. We've got the baking soda. Oh, I'm sorry, baking powder. I get those always mixed up. You got the cinnamon, you got vanilla, and you got coconut oil. You guys ready? Let's put this together. This is, I believe this is for the crust. So we're gonna mix our eggs. Our coconut oil. Our swerve. And this is only part of the swerve. The other part is gonna be used later. Our cinnamon. Almond flour, you dump that in there. And the salt and baking powder, put that in there. And we're gonna take it. And just go ahead and mix that up. You can use a mixer, you can use a fork, anything you want. You can use a whisk like us, don't matter. Okay, grab yourself a nine by 13 pan. All right, take your mixture. It should be a little moist. It should look like that, almost like a cookie dough. Okay, and you're gonna put that in here. All right, this is the part where you press everything down in the whole pan, just spread it out. This is your crust. So you're gonna wanna take a minute and do the job right. Make sure it presses nicely. If you need help, um, I would grab one of those silicone pads. I'm thinking about that on helping me in a second once I get this all spread out. I'm going to use a silicone pad to possibly flatten this. Or maybe not. Maybe I can just do it with my hand right now. Once you're done pressing it all out, it should look like something like that. All right, it's a real thin layer of crust. But once again, with that baking powder and salt in here, it's going to rise a little bit. All right, you're going to bake this for 20 minutes at 325. So go turn on your oven right now. All right, this next phase is the cream cheese topping that's gonna go over the crust. Are you guys ready? All right, put your cream cheese in. Put your eggs in. Put the other rest of the swerve in. Sweetener. And then this is combined vanilla and lemon extract and pour that in. and gently mix. And after mixing with the electric mixer, it looks smooth and creamy and delicious and sweet. And this will be poured right on top of the crust. We're just waiting for the crust to finish cooking in the oven. All right, guys, this smells amazing, the crust alone. All right, so what we're gonna do is bring in our cream cheese mixture, right? We're gonna gently pour it over the top There we go. 
make sure you scrape everything out so you get every drop. Personally, I don't like anything on top of my cream cheese um, mixture, but some people will put like a lemon zest on here. So if you want to get creative in your own, that's fine. But once you're done putting this on top of the crust, take this and put this in the refrigerator two to four hours before you slice into it. So I will see you in about four hours. And there it is, all in its beauty, ready to be tasted. You guys ready? Let's do it. Give it a little cut. Mmm. Mmm. I don't know what it is with lemon. We've been using it a lot lately. I think I'm beginning to start to like citrus. It's scaring me. This is really good, really refreshing, and a big treat for all you people trying to watch your weight, trying to watch how you eat, trying to lean more towards keto, paleo, all that. Um, give this a try. Beautiful recipe. And do me a favor. I found an organization that gives around the world food, clothing, anything they need, medicine. It's called Convoy of Hope. My wife and I are discussing about a monthly donation to this company. Um, we ask that you give directly to them. Don't go through my show. Just go straight to the link that's down below. All right? I love you guys, and I'll see you on the next episode. Bye-bye.